good morning i'm in my favorite spot at a table at a laptop well it's tuesday i had one interview today for social media i don't know i'm a bad judge if uh, if it went good or bad because it was over telephone so but um we'll see we'll see it's awesome place uh, that would be amazing to do tomorrow i have another interview but they did change the title from assistant to director they didn't change anything else uh so that's confusing you know honestly i had like a mini rebirth this weekend and i just feel so much better and like so much more in peace with myself i'm really happy and i don't know like something changed in me something changed i just realized a few things and realized that i need to seek inner validation i don't care about anybody else at this point even my husband said like oh i'm so proud of you and i was like i really appreciate it which i truly do because you know he's my husband like it's important for me to know what he thinks but at the same time i have this inner confidence and inner love in myself now that well, I do appreciate what he said. I don't think it will move or like diminish my confidence in me. So yeah, that was a very important. And I'm just so happy that I'm coming to that. There is so much work still for me to do inner work, but it's great that I'm on this path and just like separating myself from my past, my parents, and just like people pleasing, I think that would be a big, big thing for me to keep working on this year. And I'm just so happy. I'm so content with myself, truly. I'm sitting at my all-time favorite bench at the lake. It feels so good. You know what's interesting? I did not deactivate my Instagram. I logged out from it. And so ever since I do not have my Instagram anymore, there's like nothing to share on my stories and nothing to post. I mean, I still do have my Instagram page. It just, I can only access it from desktop and Obviously, I will not be uploading stories from my desktop, only if I really want to share something. But, um, and not on the stories, on the main feed. But anyways, my point is that all these moments are for me. Obviously, I'm doing like, or making TikToks and YouTube videos, but I think they're more conscious and I'm being more selective than on the stories and Instagram, like, oh, look at me bragging. Day at the lake, self-care day, coffee day, like, this is just for me. This moment is for me. I'm creating these memories and I do feel like I'm healing and I just feel so much better. And the sun is so bright, but um, I don't know. I just really enjoy this moment and it makes me happy. It truly makes me happy. well i'm just sitting doing some work working on canva working on my blog and i get an email from like to create that i finally have been accepted into the influencer program i'm shocked because i always tried to apply and was always rejected but i finally just applied with my pinterest and my blog because of the like my main platforms where i have the most followers and viewers and I've been accepted i'm so happy like what is happening universe thank you i don't know i just decided to apply today out of nowhere and i'm just so happy good morning i am in my big jacket i have an interview i came a little bit early i'm a bit nervous i had to push myself a little bit on driving myself yeah that was hard normally i think like my husband would drive me but he said no <laughs> he said you have to drive and i mean he's right about it but it was a bit stressful but the drive was easy so i'm just waiting to see um those people to interview and uh, we'll see how it goes am i nervous mm, 
not really, but we'll see how the interview itself will go. Okay, I'm home. That was my outfit. A little bit casual, but um, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I do not know how I feel about it, honestly. Um, it's not really real estate assistant role, but this is what I kind of want to do or any like social media, but we'll see. It's not the end, I'll, I'll keep going. I'll find what I want for sure. What's mine comes to me easily, 100%. I seen these things today and I think they look like nails and I think that would be fun to glue them for the Renaissance Fair or something like that or Halloween. They are pine cones and I think it's very funny how they look like Baba Yaga nails. avocado toast today i'm experimenting so no tomatoes no uh, cilantro or onions but i have some vegan parmesan cheese on top of this the bread got a little bit burned but that's okay and yes i eat three of them because i need big breakfast i started getting ready and i just want to say for the smelly girls like me this is so good i used to uh use another deodorant Sanex. I think I got it in Belgium. I don't think they sell it in the US and I love the deodorants, but recently I don't know. It's not been helping me and it's not the yet, but I got this one at Target and it's been so freaking helpful and good I don't smell bad. It's it has a very sweet smell and I never thought I would like a sweet deodorant but it smells so freaking good and I enjoy smelling myself now, like for real, if you have this issue, I feel like this one has been quite good for now. I don't know, we'll see how long it will last, but so far it's been quite good. Okay, I'm actually getting ready. I'm meeting a new person today, a new girl. Um, I hope, you know, we'll connect because I'm looking for friends and so I don't really like how I look, but I mean, it is what it is, you know. Um, it is what it is, baby. I probably will put some necklace or something. I washed my hair two days ago and the, I feel like dirty again. But my face is so round. Okay, Julia, stop talking bad things about yourself. But yeah, I'm going to choose some necklace. Okay, I actually changed. I'm wearing this, so I feel a little bit better. I'm going drifting. The meeting went well. Okay, I'm home. It was extremely nice to meet you. Oh God, I want to have crazy hair. It was extremely nice to meet new people, new person. I feel like we have a lot of. Uh, interest in common. I always feel weird because I don't know. I just feel like I don't look like myself, and I, I feel like a little bit weird. But I mean, ha I'm so happy that we met. I'm home. I'm home and just like sitting. I got a little rug for the second room at the thrift store, and a book that I was not supposed to get, but it's okay. We will not count that one because it's for hobbies. Pringle, show yourself. What is this silly boy doing? Yes, boy, I have a different approach now too. Like, I'm more positive. And it's so funny, this lady at the thrift store started talking. Started talking to me. Pringle. Oh my god. She started talking to me and just like asking me about thrift stores and stuff like that. So, and then she was like, well, have a good day. And then she was like, oh my god, I also seen this uh, baking book. 
a book about baking and then she was like well okay have a good day and then she was like well i have to ask you where are you from like well i'm from latvia and she's like latvia where is latvia i was like well it's next to russia so he's like oh i was like yes and she was like well don't feel about it i was like i actually don't <laughs> anyway so it was like a funny interaction but it's funny because i Pringle, I kind of changed my opinion about like people trying to talk to you. It used to be annoying, but I feel like approaching it from the point of, oh, people feel comfortable talking to you and sharing this story is helping. Ring. Is there anything you want to say? Is there anything you want to say? This is Pringle. I don't know, Bringo is so nice and so loving. This is my little book corner that I'll have to change. This is Pep. Pep said, oh, I want some love too. Bringo likes this basket. And he likes when you push him like that. Today's Friday. I think I'll glance very quickly at jobs, but I don't think I'll be applying. Because yesterday I applied to nine jobs and it looks like one of them was MLM. I couldn't pick it up from when I was applying. There is a UNC uh, Chapel Hill, I think this is how it's called. But anyways, there is a position, so I, I want to finish that one. But we'll see about other jobs. I wrote in my calendar or in my agenda, I applied to two to three jobs. Yesterday when I was applying to jobs and when I applied to eight, uh, actually nine jobs, I decided to look up how many is recommended and it's recommended two to three per day, so like 10 to 15 a week. And when I applied to those jobs yesterday, I was like, oh my God, I literally spent hours and hours and hours working on the cover letter, applying to uh, on the websites. It was really stressful. So let's see if there are any updates on applied. Oh my god, I'm kind of scared. Don't see really anything, but yes, a lot of applications for assistant property manager. I applied for library job as well. Those are not the jobs that I would necessarily would want to have as a career, but I think that would be great. To just start and just having a library job would be amazing. It's a government job and I think that one was a full-time position, so I wouldn't mind. But yes, just sticking to what I want and what I like, so we'll see and just getting more professional. I'm definitely excited about starting a new journey, but we'll see how it will go because it is stressful, let me tell you, it is stressful, so. And you also have to be careful not to apply to any MLMs. Apparently I messed up and I did it, so. <laughs> that sucks. 